What about something like that Meg feature? That seems like the kind of thing that a label would help make happen. I bro, the label never did it for me as far as features. Yeah. That's what I'ma say. Every feature was me and my relationships. I've been knowing Meg, bro. Like it was even a time, bro, like I was trying to sign Meg. You really? know what I'm saying? She know that her mama and all that shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? I Before was, Carl Crawford. Hell yeah, yeah. Really? Shout out Carl, you know what I'm saying? The whole shit. Shout out Meg, you know what I'm saying? But hell yeah. Megan used to, bro. She used to come to parties with the Hennessy bottle and turn the fuck up. Right. Rapping and shit. Like, I've been knowing Meg. You feel me? Wow, that's crazy. What could have been? If you had done that, that would have been fucking I caught that Rika. I'm like, fuck that. I got to put this money into me. Really? So when you hey, met her, yeah. was she, like, not on anything? She was just having a few songs out or what? She was she was known for freestyling. She went to Prairie View at first. Right. So, like, she was known, like, I think she was on a dance team or something like that. Just going to parties, turn up freestyling. She would go to parties and just rap and wow. go fed. That's fucking crazy. Damn, she's she she's got to be like a huge deal in in Texas in general. You just hear like girls listening to her wherever you go and shit. See, I went to the Beyonce concert and she came out. Really, and they went crazy. Wow, shout out to Meg. Um, how do you feel about uh, my man Crip Mac? That I, I wanted to bring you guys together, but like I feel like that should maybe be something we do after we catch up because I feel like he's he's such an amount of energy associated with him. How do how do you feel about him? Bye bye, Crip. Right. Crip, how I feel about him? I feel like shit, we can get in the ring and fight for some money. Oh, wow. But I ain't about to do no game banging with no nigga go back and forth. Niggas know what the fuck I do to niggas. So, what, the, the forehead ta tattoo has you feeling a sort of way? Shit, my set stopped banging Hoover. Like, oh. I went to war with my set behind that shit before I retired. Really? Like, you know what I'm saying? But everybody, everybody in my set got Hoover tatted on them. But it's not like on some shit like, fuck, like, you know what I'm saying? Hoover or something. It's just like, bro, Houston, Texas is. 90% Hoover. Right. But wait, so why did your team stop with it? Right. It was some shit, man. It was just like some shit with like the older niggas jail and shit like that. Uh -huh. Like, you know what I'm saying? Then like us, like nigga, we was the Hoovers. Like we brought that shit to A-Leaf on the Southwest side, Fort right. Park Murder Block. Like, you know what I'm saying? Niggas know about this shit, but it was just like some politics shit, like everybody Hoover. Right. So somebody like, you feel me? So just separate. Wow, that's interesting. Shit like that. But yeah, I don't game bang no more, you know what I'm saying? Nothing like that. You know, FPC stands for Forever Protect the Community. Mm. So like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it was Foreign Park Crip, you know what I'm saying? Oh, but right. Forever Protect the Community, like, if you catch me out there, I'm shooting a video or I'm giving back. Like, you know what I'm saying? I ain't out there thugging, sitting on no block, shit like that. You feel me? Because we already got the reputation. Niggas are scared of us, bro. Right. Niggas play dead for they play with us. Really? Like, you know what I'm saying? And we know, we not even on that time. Like, you know what I'm saying? Come and being all tough and shit. Niggas trying to get some money on and, you know. You feel like the cops have it out for you or do you feel like the cops are starting to look at you like a, a good citizen? Man, last time I was in jail was fan cops. Really? Hell yeah. Them niggas, is, I don't say fan that they know the real. The bailiff they used to get on our ass. Remember the big um Missy Elliott? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? The one they used to get on our shoes come that hoe. Swole in the mother. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but then she'd come with like a Snoop Dogg dude in the perm. I'm like, look, she's still a woman. Right. Like, you know what I'm saying? But... Recently, she came up to me. She was like, yeah, man. They just dragging this case on. Like, you know what I'm saying? The DA fucking got it out for you. Ooh. Everybody in jail, like, the fucking, um, all the COs is fucking with me. Really? You know what I'm saying? They jamming my music and shit like that. Give me that speech. Like, man, you're bigger than these guys, man. Because mm. when I was in that hole, they was, I was a king. I had, like, three assistants. <laughs> Everything. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, riding all night. Everybody was having fun. We was playing basketball. We, like, turning up. And then they thought that I was in there, like, having a good time. Right. I'm like, nah, nigga, it's jail, but shit, nigga, wherever I'm at, I'm going to make the best of something. Right, because you must be, like, a fucking king in the county jail there. I mean, you just. I mean, niggas fuck with me. Right. But you got yeah, enemies yeah. in there, too? People aren't happy to see I you having no a good time? I no ops. No? It's just Hell not like nah. that, or? Nah, like, all my ops is dead or in jail or broke. Really? Hell yeah, I don't really got no ops. I get love for the niggas that's a so-called ops. They love my music. They kids love my music and shit. You know, I'm older. I've been thugging. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I'm older now on my corporate shit. So, like, you know what I'm saying? Plus, a lot of shit, like, I see a nigga. Like, I see a nigga, nigga, um, pop that. I see a nigga, nigga, done robbed and shit. Then they give me a speech. They be like, you know, I ain't even tripping on that shit, bro. Just keep doing what you do. I know you was younger. Woo, woo, woo. Right. Like, that shit done happened before. Could you be that mature about somebody having done something like that to you? I ain't never been robbed. Let's say that. You ran into somebody that had shot at you in the past ten years ago. Hell yeah, I have. You're over it, or or we had still a talk. Up? You have a talk. I don't see any that shot at me. I caught him with his kids. You know what I'm saying? But I ain't on that kind of shit. Like you know what I'm saying? I I get it, nigga. I ain't dead, bro. You feel me? It's other niggas that 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 that, that had the ah, Why the fuck I'm stuttering today? It's because Adam got me on this fucking blanco. It might be because you're shoving fucking blunt roaches into the bong. 
But it's his show. And, and look, I seen your sneaky ass like hitting it where you did you didn't even break off the piece. You were just holding it in there and shit. I'm like, what's all your life is? You talk about sneaky ass. Yeah, I ain't yeah. good at him. <laughs> I ain't got a sneaker do nothing. And right after we done talking about Crip Mac, we're going to talk about you and my niggas on back on feed, cuz. Oh, you know shit. how we coming in this motherfucker. I got to bring you yeah, something to here, but yeah. We back on Melrose now, but uh, what, what what about back on Fig? No, because oh. you, we ain't done with Crip Mac. Hold up, hold up. <laughs> Let's start there. This blunt go kick it in. Okay, no, but this is this is what my one encounter with it. I'm going to look for topics for Max O' Cream. I'm taking notes. I see a clip on back on Fig. It's a clip called... Max O'Cream talks about his beef with Sauce Walker. I'm thinking in my head, Missy. I'm like, did he ever have beef with Sauce Walker? I, I don't know that to be a fact. So I, I'm kind of, I'm curious. These I click on it, and I start reading the comments before I even get into the clip, and I realize you obviously had a very famous fight in a parking lot with Rizzo Rizzo, not Sauce Walker. Yeah. So that's why you need to come fuck with professional operations because they won't give you the wrong ops in the title of the video. Nah, thanks, man. <laughs> Shout out Sauce Walker. All right, bet. Back, back to Crip Mac. Cuz, you know it's cracking. Shout out Jap 5, pre Jap 5, you know what I'm saying? Mm. But, like, you know what I'm saying, bro? It is what it is. I ain't about to game bang with him, cuz, bro, it's, it's, it's like, first off, this LA. Y'all better his head tat. Every nigga, lip up brick baby shirt. Every nigga got that shit tatted on him. And guess what? My homies got that shit too. Mm. I got homies, I got criminals that got CK on them. Mm. You know the five deuces, you know what I'm saying? We still Keyway. Right. You know what I'm saying? Form Park, we Keyway too. But like, I'm just saying, like, you know what I'm saying? So I don't even get into all that shit because everybody got them kind of tats. You know mm. what I'm saying? It's just like, he be talking about the Houston niggas and shit like that. I went to Hastings. Mm. The nigga he talking about Fabio, asked Fabio about my cripping back in the day and about Trigger Maxo. Mm. Trigger Maxo C before Maxo Cream. He know that shit. I don't like. And then he said Hastings Elsick, but I think he kind of slow. Wait, Trigger Maxo, that was a, like a hood name for you at the time? Hell yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. You know what I'm saying? I can't I imagine how you got that name. You ain't never heard of him? No, <laughs> I remember you saying that on songs and shit, but that, I didn't know that I was like a formal. Yeah, nah, but shit showed up before Maxo Cream. It was Maxo C, you know what I'm saying? Boom. So like, but I think Crip Mac kind of slow because he talking about Hastings Elsick. That mean that he went. He was in the annex. That's where the schools connect. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? That's where like the Spanish class is at. The ESL like like and like the kind of slow kids, you know what I'm saying? So that's why I ain't getting in the game banging with him. He just started. I've been doing this shit since 2003, since I was 13. You feel me? We could fight and look, it'll be bro. That should have made money. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I feel like that should have made money. Now I ain't doing it for no money. I don't even be on that kind of shit. But it's like you keep like you know what I'm saying throwing shit back. You know that niggas a YouTube. I'm a rapper. Really? Like you know what I'm saying? I don't be on that YouTube shit like you know, but. Shit, put some money on, I do that shit. Would it be something where if you won the fight, would you shake hands with him afterwards or would you Hell spit yeah, on know. his ass afterwards? I ain't. <laughs> This two options. There's only two ways for a fight to end. This nigga had him freaky. But, but you look, know you know about the savage life, right? Nigga, I know about the Chicago <laughs> shit. Shout out Rico Reckless, bro. Rico Reckless, my boy. You know what you I'm saying? Crit Mac with the Glock Dookie, you might want to stay out of LA for a while. Man. Child, I, I roam bro. <laughs> Brick Baby is my nigga. Right. Brick is my Does nigga. Does he have HK tattoos? I haven't seen it. He I got probably it. do, bro. He got a song called Back to Slauson. Uh-huh. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. Oh, my God. 